I've brought you something. Oh, Hal. Is this for me? This must have cost you a fortune. But I like it very much, thank you. You really mustn't bring me any more gifts like that, or you'll spoil me. So, uh, how have you been? I can't stop thinking about Scalitz. I know. It was hell. But life has to go on. Why not clear your head and try to forget about it? At least for now. What do you mean? Do you feel like a walk? That's not a bad idea. And where would you care to go? What if we took a stroll along the river? Why not? That sounds lovely. Shall we go? Let's go. That was a good idea to go for a walk. Not that I don't like the mill, but you get tired of it. So I'm glad you took me out. I'd love to see the markets in Prague one day. Have you ever been to Prague? No, I haven't. I have been in Kuttenberg, but Prague must be much bigger. <laughs> I've heard it's pretty smelly, though. Yeah, so many people in one place. So many assholes. <laughs> That's disgusting. I'd love to listen to that young preacher, Jan Hus. They say he preaches in the common tongue. Everyone's talking about it. I bet he's just handsome. That's why the women dote on him. <laughs> You're a right one. A preacher doesn't need good looks for people to listen to him. And what about that fine fellow at St. James? I know full well why all the girls have started going to confession, and you have too. So don't give me any of that. <laughs> you scoundrel. Well, all right. I admit I find him handsome. But that doesn't make me a bad Christian. I'd never dare to suggest such a thing. Tell you what. Let's not doddle. Last one is a slimy slug. to eat. <laughs> that was fun. Sit down here next to me, Hal. What about you? I heard you're helping Sir Radzig. Sir Radzig has me running in a few errands. I have to say, he always treats me well, and I make a wage. So you've had your turn of luck. What's it like serving nobility? Oh, this endless luxury, money, banquets, games stuffed with other games. <laughs> a chicken stuffed with... stuffed with a frog? Yeah, and that's nothing compared to a frog stuffed with a chicken. <laughs> a goat stuffed... <laughs> <laughs> with a pig? Now then. Oh, Henry, what am I going to do with you? Wandering the land, turning innocent girls' heads.
The only one here whose head is all messed up is me. How do you always manage to look so good? Just look at the lady killer. Where did you learn to talk that way? Mm. I don't recall which church service it was exactly. <laughs> you scoundrel. But you certainly know how to make a girl feel special. You may continue. But now I have to go. Can I go with you? Just a little way. I don't want anyone to gossip. Thank you for coming with me. Please come and see me again. I'd love to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Welcome, Henry. I'm glad you came. Here I am. I'm overjoyed. Have you got a horse? No, sir. Where would someone like me get a horse? Good point. Unless it was a cart horse, I suppose. Well, you just have to trot along behind me like a good dog. But, sir, isn't there a horse I could borrow? Oh, certainly. Why don't you just have mine? Or, then again, you can just run alongside as befits a peasant. I feel quite hungry. I 
I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Just that when you said those things in the arena, sir, I, I was um, a little upset. Ah, I'd just like to tease Greenhorns a little. And you vexed me too. You were insolent to Captain Bernard and they rewarded you with service. Whenever I do anything reckless, even if it's for my honour, Panos is on my back about it and I get punished. Like now. I didn't mean to threaten anyone. Well, it's all water under the bridge. Let's not spoil our hunt. Something else. Is this your first time hunting? This kind? Yes. I've been hunting since I could walk. If you're not a complete blockhead, you might learn something useful. And if you don't cock it up entirely today, maybe I'll take you again. It's always helpful to have a minion at hand. As I said, I have hunted before, but it wasn't... Chasing bunnies with a pitchfork isn't hunting. Observe and learn. I'll do the best I can. So I don't know if that's a suitable topic of conversation for the hunt. We're not hunting yet. I'd like to hear about it at last from someone who was actually there. Humans attacked skullets and um, anyone who didn't flee. That's what they all say. I want detail. Is it really necessary, sir? Arguing with the nobility again, eh? It seems you're a bit of a rebel. No, not at all, sir. It's just that... Well hard for me to talk about. I see. So I'll have to get you drunk first. Not sure even that would work. We'll have to find out, won't we? There's a nice little place just north of here. We'll camp there and you can tell me all about it. If you wish, sir. And don't dilly-dally. Let's try and get there before the day's out. Starting to get hungry. Bring me wine and bacon from the saddlebag.
My horse, saddlebag, wine. Coming up, sir. At long last. So, are you enjoying being on the hunt? I am, although we haven't actually hunted anything yet. That doesn't matter. Hunting is a diversion. The main thing is to get out of Ratte for a while. Listening to Hanush's lectures all day long would drive anyone mad. What are we going to hunt? Cumans. What? Cumans? there. <laughs> we'll see what we can get. But I'd like to bag a boar. One, at least. And a few hares, too, eh? But what about you? Before I couldn't get a word out of you, now your tongue's loosened. So, tell me about Scallets. I heard Sigismund had a hundred banners there. I don't know, sir. I didn't have time to count them. Both of my parents were killed in Scalitz, right in front of my eyes. The Cumans slaughtered my friends and neighbours, and it was a miracle I got away. I don't know what else I can add. I'm sorry about that. But tell me, I heard in the tavern... What, that Sigismund flew down on a dragon? That the Cumans have horns and hooves? I'm sorry, my lord, but for me, Scalitz isn't a tale of adventure to share over a tankard of ale. All right. I understand. Well, never mind. Anyway, it's too late to go anywhere today. But tomorrow we set off at first light. Got it? Yes, sir. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Sir, wake up, sir. It's time to go. Oh, what? Are you mad? It's still dark. I thought we were going to get an early start, sir. Early means at first light. Light, you dolt. Do you want me to break my neck in the black of night? Go back to sleep. Damn it. What are you waiting for? Your lord requires you for the hunt. Oh, really? Such a renowned hunter needs help. You wouldn't dare mock your betters now, would you? Oh, heaven forbid, your lordship. If that's the way you want it, peasant, we'll meet back here at noon. Whoever has the most hairs wins. Oh, and if you don't have anything to shoot with, there's a crate in the camp with some old hunting equipment. You can help yourself. After all, there's no sport in trouncing some wretch who hasn't a chance in hell. Maybe I was a bit hasty, sir. Too late, dung grubber. You can't back out now. And now turn your back for a while. I know a few tried and tested spots in these woods, and I don't want you stealing them. I feel quite hungry.
did the hunt go for you, sir? I did quite well. Look, why do you ask? You were right on my ass the whole time. Not bad, though. Quite good, actually. For a common blacksmith's boy. Um, shouldn't there be some reward for the victor? Jesus, the insolence. A serf asking his lord for coin. But never let it be said I'm a pinch purse. Very well, then. Your serf humbly thanks you, my lord. And now, come along. Let's go and hunt some real game. Could do with a bite to eat. See here, a wallow, and it's been freshly rooted. There'll be boar somewhere nearby. So, just like last time, slow and quiet, whatever you do. Understand? But watch out for them from the top of that mound there. Spears. Is that so? So now all of a sudden you're a master huntsman, are you? Watch and learn. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> Damn, I'm good. <laughs> Quiet. So next time you try to tell me I can't kill a boar with an arrow, you can. <laughs> Fuck. After him, fetch. <laughs> Mount up, Henry! Chase down that swine! 